Hi, welcome to Wyoming Greats. My name is Earl. I'm Cheyenne's only licensed stream musician. I'm down here at the Cheyenne Depot at the Farmer's Market. In this episode of Wyoming Greats, we're going to be checking out the Farmer's Market. 12 years now, we got Pine Air Art. And music by me, Earl. I have Harvey DeSelms, I own DeSelms Fine Art and Custom Framing. Uh, I've had my own gallery here in Cheyenne for 18 years now. So we're right next to the Plains Hotel and I have a great view of the, uh, the Depot Square. So uh, it makes a perfect place to, to come and, and, and uh, bring quick some artists in and have the, the plein air event because we have such a, a great view of the plaza, you know, the farmer's market's going on today. And we have many of the artists, um, well, probably about 30 artists altogether, or maybe a little bit more out there on the plaza in, in various little corners uh, they're painting and producing pieces of artwork to be auctioned later. Different quick draws in different places are, are, are limited on different times but I think ours is about 90 minutes and they start with a blank canvas and they kind of point which way they want to choose like I mentioned before some are doing buildings. It's good I am a little tight by time but I, I think I can finish it. Some, you know, have, you'll set up some peppers on a, on a table and do a little still life. Went in my mom's backyard and painted her flowers. Um, I do wildlife art, and so the past week I was in Yellowstone documenting the bison rut. So I kind of didn't plain air as much as I'd hoped to. I tense at the farmer's market. It's been going great, except that they've moved the cantaloupes about five times and there's people standing in front of what I'm painting all the time. Otherwise, it's wonderful. <laughs> Having a good time. And they just have a limited amount of time to do that, that one piece. And uh, in that, you really, it, it, it's, a, it's kind of fun for the public to watch the piece being created from a blank canvas to, to something that, that they could potentially own. And it's good for the artist to you know, as I mentioned before, when the artist would go out and do a, a sketch outside to get the color right and get the composition right and stuff, you know, that's a good test for them. It's, a, it's an exercise in being able to, to put something together quickly and get the right color and everything like that. And then after the quick draws over, things are, are, are framed and taken over to the Plains Hotel and we'll auction off the pieces that were created this morning. And I think that plein air really uh, was, was generated from artists going out, you know, studio artists, when they go out to the field, they go outside and look at, you know, what they want to paint, a mountain scene or something like that. And they go out and really try to mix their palette and get the right color and, you know, they're looking. And, and so it, it kind of is a, it, it is a, a lot of plein air paintings or test pilots for, for, for a, a bigger studio painting. So that's, uh, it, 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 and it's fun to just watch them because, you know, they just get intent and they're just painting away. And, you know, the cloud comes over and they have to kind of you change your perspective a little bit. So it's a, it's a fun, fun venue. Well, events like plein air and anything we try to do downtown Cheyenne, I mean, especially the plein air because it's an art event. It brings art to people and it brings people to art. You know, the more exposure that we can get um, in and around downtown of, of the art. So we have several people out there that are painting the buildings, they're painting the farmer's market, which is another event that is downtown. Anything that people can come and, and feel interactive with downtown. Um, you know, often, you know, I think downtown gets a little stale when we don't have these cultural events. I mean, every time we have an event down here, we get more people down and more people down and they come here and they have a good time and they remember the good time and they get to see their friends and neighbors and it's just uh, everything like that benefits, um, benefits all of us that have a, an interest in downtown and it benefits the whole community because I think a, a strong downtown you know, it leaks out to the rest of the community because there's kind of a center of town and a, and a place that people have a lot of pride in. And certainly, you know, like the, the film festival and the plein air and uh, the Celtic music festival and a number of events that, that are down here focused in the plaza and downtown help, help that uh, pride of place that people have for Cheyenne. Ninety-five. Eighty-five. Ninety-five. 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 